Have you ever noticed that when you drop these two balls, they don't return to the same height? If you don't believe me, watch this. I'm dropping it from a meter high. And look, it only got right to there. Now, for the tennis ball. So how does this happen? Well, anytime you drop a ball, it starts out with a potential energy due to its height. And when you drop it, it loses energy when it hits the ground. And it loses it to thermal energy. So now what do you think will happen if we drop them on top of each other? Let's find out. But wait, where did the tennis ball get the extra energy? So here's the physics explanation behind where the extra energy came from. So here's how it happens. The two balls, when they drop, the ball compresses into the ground while the tennis ball compresses into the ball. These compressions create elastic potential energy, which, which all transfers into the tennis ball, giving it the extra energy to escalate to new heights.